what is up mga ka tech shop so for today's video i'm gonna be showing you how to repair or replace lcd for oppo a53 but before that i'm just gonna show you my halin sa piso wifi see you lang mga ka tech shop binagmay but at least it's kanunay ako na siya bang basically halin is siya sa piso wifi sa print o sa gcash cash in cash out po na siya tabang mga katik shop anyway let's go ahead with the repair so if you're new to this channel don't forget to like and subscribe para updated mo sa mga videos nga akong ipang upload and all the tools that I've been using on my repairs is on the description whether it is on YouTube or Facebook page so this is an Oppo A53 I think the customer dropped the phone and then the screen no longer work so don't forget to like and subscribe So first step is to testing, verify what is the issue. And as you can see here, I plug in the charger. It vibrates, but uh, the display is garbage because it's because uh, uh, the customer dropped the phone. And uh, the only way to fix this is to replace LCD. So again, I'm just gonna. Um, mention again that this the tools that I've been using on this repair is on the description So to, to start the repair we'll just need to apply heat on the back cover so we can remove it and then remove the old glues and then remove the screws on the back cover Start prying the edges, remove the SIM card tray first and be careful on the volume button and power button because you might uh, damage it while, while uh, removing the back cover. So just be very careful. Also for this model, you have fingerprint sensor or fingerprint scanner you gotta be careful with removing the back cover because we don't want to damage the volume power and the fingerprint sensor while the process of removing the back cover so back cover has been removed We'll need to test the new LCD before attaching it to the phone. So again, I suggest to take a video when testing the new LCD. Just in case the LCD doesn't work, you can still return it to the supplier. And show the video. So we attach the battery and plug in the new LCD. And turn it on. So LCD looks good, the port looks good, let's go ahead and test it. Alright, so once again the tools that I've been using on this repair is on the description. Um, you can also visit uh, involve Asia for affiliate marketing it's gonna 
add you additional income if you have that uh, account so basically that account or that website uh, if you promote an item and then somebody clicked on the link and ordered and you'll get a commission so please check on my video regarding alpha affiliate marketing and regarding the involve asia website it's on the link it's on the description so right now i'm testing the new lcd i just plug in the flex cable of the lcd and then power it on so here display is working we just need to wait for the touch and the touch is working as well so we can go ahead and assemble the phone so to start with assembling the phone we'll need to remove the battery first because we'll be applying a lot of heat on the broken lcd so we can remove it I'm using a heat gun apply heat and using blade to pry it blade and prying tool tool and before putting a new glue we'll need to remove some old glue from the frame now we're ready to attach the new LCD so flex cable has its own adhesive we wanna remove that plastic and then we'll start applying glue on the edges attach the new LCD and use rubber band and clamps to hold the LCD in place and wait for an hour after an hour we can assemble the phone and test it and don't forget to put glue on the battery and that's that is it make sure to clean the back cover remove the old glue and assemble the phone so basically that's it if you have additional uh, if you have comments or suggestions, just put it on the comment section. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Let's go!